This is probably the hardest intro we've ever had in the history of the channel. We've sold the Lyft yeah. smart car. I drove her two, two times. One of the times I drove her, I got stuck in the mud in the backyard. Let's go, baby. Come on, smart. There's a time for joy and there's a time for pain. You hate to see her go, but you love to watch her leave. I have something very special to share with you guys today. Something I've been hiding from you for quite a while. It's in the garage. It's also very cold today. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. And check these out from Fitman Industries from Motegi. We have the new wheels for the Nissan Z. Nissan Z, It's on summer tires and it's rear wheel drive and I just stole it because it's a manual I'm trying to talk to you guys. It's got a new color. In a perfect world, that would've been a perfect donut. Check out the new wrap on the Z. It turned out so sick. The Z is gonna be done today. I know it's been a long time since you guys saw the Nissan Z. So underneath the wrap, it is Nardo gray. We have the white RWV wheels. So KPMS satin blue wrap by your boy Clayton up at Summit Auto Lab, the best of the best. Now we're gonna swap out the wheels here momentarily for the Motegis. Obviously the fitment is trash. I dig her. He's been getting a lot of hate. Really? This is actually ridiculous. We're not moving even a fraction. The car sounds crazy good though. The only problem with the Nissan Z, it's not very good in the snow. We got stuck. We made it. We're gonna engage full off-road mode. See if that helps. Come on. It's nearly impossible to get any kind of footing or traction. If I spin the rear tires long enough, we'll hit dry pavement, right? I I'm gonna get this! Come on, come on! You just gotta rock her like a baby. Get it, get it, get it! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Oh my gosh! This is insane! Never not post it! That's sick! Are you actually kidding me? I know there's been a lot of hate for the Nissan Z, but you gotta admit. That Fitment is absolute perfection. On that bombshell, today's video has been sponsored by none other than Fitment Industries. Now, if you have a car, you modify a car, or you accessorize a car, you gotta check out fitmentindustries.com. They are truly the ultimate one-stop shop for wheels, tires, performance, suspension, and accessories. And guys, when I say they have wheel options, they have so many different wheel options. They have every color, every style, every size you could ever imagine. And their online gallery makes it so easy to visualize what color, what style, what size is gonna look perfect on your car. You guys know when it comes to wheel size, to tire size, to offset, to fitment, I'm not your guy. I have no idea what I'm doing. And when you have a custom wide body kit, you can't be kind of perfect or close to perfect. You have to be Perfect. If you guys need custom wheels, give Fitman Industries a call. You're not talking to a computer, you're not talking to AI, you're talking to a real human being who is helpful and who is knowledgeable. And with Fitman Industries, you can actually bundle your tires and wheels together, ensuring that your wheel size and your tire size are perfect. They'll even mount them, they'll balance them, they'll install TPMS sensors. With Fitman Industries, it's so easy. It's too easy. Now it goes without saying, next time you modify your car or you accessorize your car, your first stop has to be fitmanindustries.com. They also have tons of different financing options available. Use my code Stradman at checkout. Check out the link in the description below or simply visit FitmanIndustries.com. You know when something is just a bad idea but you're gonna do it anyways? That's exactly what's going on. Later in the day, we're not gonna be able to get the Z up the driveway, but we gotta get to Envision. Well, now that we are officially on the drive pavement, we gotta do a proper walk around the Nissan Z. So many people hate this car. So many people want me to sell this car, but it's beautiful. Either I've gone crazy or I'm factually accurate. That is a beautiful side profile. Forget, forget that, don't look at that. Focus on the side profile, that's beautiful. And the rear three quarters is even better, like that angle right there. You have to admit, you got the FI exhaust. That is the angle, the problem is, Right there. The only issue is when you walk closer and closer and closer to the car, right around here, that kind of shows itself. And then as you get lower and lower and lower, it gets worse and worse and worse. I've owned this car for nearly a year, and in the state of Utah, I've only seen one other Nissan Z. Where are the Zs? Did Nissan not sell any of them? When I bought my Mark V Toyota Super, I got one of the first ones in the entire world, but a year after I owned the car, they were everywhere. Is it too expensive? I wanna say base MSRP on this car was 55,000, but my Toyota Supra was also 55,000. I think the Supra is better looking, it sounds better, but this has a manual transmission and it has more horsepower. 
I don't know. I didn't even plan for this whatsoever. We got a Mark V Super right here. The front end of that car is 10 times more beautiful. And honestly, the front end of a car is the most important angle, so. Of course, I have to remind everybody, the front end of this car is aftermarket. That is a Panda front end. That being said, the factory, the stock Nissan Z front end is so bland. It's it's not better, it's not worse. They're both not great and, and they're both not terrible. They're just, they're not it. My big issue when I bought this car was the sound of the exhaust, but that FI has completely fixed everything. <laughs> That was a cool tires. <laughs> nobody's driven a Nissan Z because nobody's bought a Nissan Z. That was a lot of wheel spin. Forward driving aids, temporary disabled, front sensor blocked. That's because I have an aftermarket front bumper on the car. Those check engine lights are always going to be on. I know. The parking sensors are going off like crazy because the sensors are blocked by the bumper, so it's sensing something, but it's nothing. And then, yeah, all day, every day. It's constant. They're, they go off all the time. Every time I come to a stop. The Viper GTS is the car that started my love, my passion for everything car. Someday, one day, I want to buy a 97 blue with white stripe. That car, what is it, 25 years later, is still beautiful. Off camera, Nate was just pointing out how nice it's been that I haven't been at the shop Dude, lately. It's been a great winter. Your great most winter. annoying client is <laughs> back finally. Also, a little bit of America right there, red, white, and blue. Why have we not seen any other Nissan Zs? I've seen one other in the state of Utah. Why? Because there's more Supras. I know. That's what I was trying to say. Yes. But wouldn't you argue the Supra is better in almost every single way except manual transmission, 400 horsepower. But this car with the wide body kit is a game changer. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The, the wide body kit and the wheels. That's what made it. Right. Now we're swapping out the Nissan Z for something very, very, very special. Oh, my goodness. How I have missed the carbon fiber event. So you might remember we had the front illegal window tent. That's been removed. We have an oil change. We have TP mess sense as well. The rear logo is also pink and that looks sick. Oh, show that again. <laughs> that came out of nowhere. That's so, did you do that? Uh, yeah, the guys did it. Wow, the attention to detail on that is so crazy. That matches perfectly. Now we also have one more trick up our sleeve here at Envision. If we hit the unlock button, ladies and gentlemen, we're going straight back to Tokyo. We finally got the underglow on the carbon car. This car with the Aventador Roadster rolling together underglow, pink underglow. That's yes. gonna be, we're gonna get a lot of trouble. A yeah. lot, a lot of trouble, but you know what? It's worth it. What can you say or state on the legalities of underglow here in the state of Utah? Yes, right? Utah Highway Patrol is not gonna give me a hard time whatsoever. You heard it here first. I, uh... <laughs> is underglow legal here, Tyrell? <laughs> Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So Nate did some kind of like voodoo magic, some Hogwarts kind of nonsense. This has voice activation. So as I'm talking, the underglow is going. I stop talking, underglow stops. So we're gonna play my outro song, Vicento Sentimento. How did you do this? Who is this guy? Don't, don't, don't put this on me. This is why I haven't seen you in two months. He's been hustling away at this. Are you still sleeping upstairs in your den? Uh, unfortunately not. It's so cool. But at the same time, why? But why not? Why not? Why not? Right? Why not? <laughs> this car looks so crazy. I love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> Your car talks to me. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> So you guys don't know this, but Friday is a very special day for Mr. Naderade. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Nate. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Thank you. than the full carpet of Aventador. It just looks so crazy. It's so perfect from every single angle. I wish it was darker right now, but the sun is going down. Nady, come on, come on. Pop it just a little bit. No, let her warm up. Yeah. Let her warm up. We'll chit chat, we'll yeah. warm her up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll just give her a little bit. You're not a little bit alone. That is so sick. So Nate is nice enough to let us leave the Z at Envision. Obviously, I can't get that up the driveway, so we're going to take the events home. Let me know what you guys think of the Z in the comments below. Obviously, we kind of have like those squared off fenders, kind of like the C8 Corvettes. I don't love them. I don't hate them. That's how the kit comes. But I do love the cutout for the gas cap, even though the gas cap is like four times too big. The more and more heat cycles, the better and better it gets. This thing from factory is an absolute disaster, but it's not bad. Also, the satin blue is so good. Whoa, 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 okay. When in doubt, 
air it out. It's honestly not even fair to the Nissan Z to film the event through a coupe at the exact same time because this car has double the cylinders, it's got nearly double the power, and it's probably like 10 times cooler. Also, it is 10 times louder. Anytime, Nady. Any, any, anytime. Yes, sir. Everybody. Yes, sir. Let's hear it. Let him go. You ran her out of gas. She's empty. Just Literally. Me to rev. She's empty. You give this guy an event where he just revs it all day. <laughs> right? It's, un out there. it's uncanny. All right. Thanks, dude. See ya. Care of her. Yes, sir. It feels good to be back in the event door. This thing absolutely sings. Well, unfortunately, it's 5 o'clock traffic. So that's all we're going to get. This Katani absolutely sings, though. Can the carbon event door make it up the driveway? Without getting stuck. We have all-wheel drive, so it should be totally fine. That's why I love Lamborghini. The all-wheel drive here in the north, it just comes in clutch every single day. I might have shattered a window. That's crazy. I better open up the garage door before I die of carbon monoxide, but you know what? Whew. This whole idea of underglow by voice command to me is hilarious, especially here in the garage where it echoes. I'm gonna go silent. Hey, yo. So we have like 50 different options. We can kind of just sort of scroll through them all. I'm not sure what any of these are. We got the wave, we got chasing, red, white, and blue. Little God bless America right there. This car though, the underglow, it just fits it so well. It's just too cool. It's so childish, I know, but it just, it is what, it's a full carbon event door with pink wheels. Like the underglow definitely fits. Now the lifted smart car has been sold, which is ironic because when I bought that over almost nearly a year ago, last February, I said that I was gonna get a snowplow mounted to that and that was gonna be my solution because I'm constantly getting cars stuck in the snow in my driveway and they'll fast forward a year I sell the lifted smart car and then the same day I get the Nissan Z stuck in the snow. However, I have a solution and that's why I sold the lifted smart car. I have purchased a snow plow. It's going to be here momentarily. Maybe the next video, maybe not, but coming very, very, very soon. But on that bombshell, today's video is over. <laughs>